I run today I'll show this Nikon F1 Photomic Viewfinder and how does exposure work on this okay first off you need to turn on your your light meter so how you do that is that you see here there's a button you must make sure that the red the red ring is exposed if the red ring is not exposed then it means that the light meter is off so to off it so actually this is what is stated in the manual why they want to off the light meter is to prevent the battery drain so how you off it is to press this down see okay now the viewfinder is off and you can see that okay see i know does not move even though i change the shutter speed see nothing works okay but if i press the button down so if i press let me focus if i press this button to release to release the button here if i press here you turn on the real fine turn on the light meter and you can see the inside you can see through here you can see that the light meter actually responds to my shutter speed see as I change the shutter speed, you can see the light meter needle moving. So it means that it's actually working. And when I off it, when I press this button, when I press it, while being bouncing through the viewfinder, see it offs. So there you go. And one thing I realized that, and I wish I find very nice and beautiful, is that you can see the shutter speed through the viewfinder. It's all fully mechanical, very nice. Okay, so see as I change the shutter speed, you can see the numbers. It's all fully mechanical and optical at the same time. So nice. So yeah, there you go. This is how exposure works on the Nikon F1 with a photomic viewfinder. On the other hand, there's also a meter on top here that you can use to meter the subject. So, as you can see here, the metering actually corresponds to my changing of my shutter speed. But uh, if I keep the shutter speed, let's say like uh, 250, it also corresponds to my aperture selection. So you can see here, see? Interesting. So yeah, there you go. Very nice. If you find this video helpful, please like, subscribe, and share. And thank you so much for joining by. See you guys next time. Bye.